So you know that old saying, if you can't beat them, join them? Extraction specialist. Delightful. <laughs> Are you playing my taxes deck? Yeah, buddy. <laughs> 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 I love it. Don't worry, this is still a taxes channel. Today, Josh is playing Chips Extractor Taxes List. The list is a pretty stock standard mono white taxes list, but is running four copies of Extraction Specialist to recur its destroyed or discarded creatures, as well as four copies of Charming Prince to recur a full battlefield of creatures. Chip is playing Fluffy Wolf 2's 8 Moon Spaghetti List, a prison list that uses four copies of Blood Moon, Magus of the Moon, and Chalice of the Void to lock out your opponent, and uses Plainbound Accomplice and Lucker to cheat in an Emrakul as early as turn one. Due to an administration error on Fluffy Wolf 2's side, Chip's deck list is not running a Progenitus in the sideboard, which might come in handy against Solitude. So let's hope that's not relevant. Round one. Oh, I have won the die roll. Yes. I'm excited. All right, well, I will go first. Um, that's that's a no from me, dog. I'm going to mulligan. I think this is a keep. Mm. This one's not great, but I'm going to keep. Excellent. Throw that away. Mountain go. All right. Doro. Monster card. Oh, planes into Esper Sentinel. <laughs> yeah, well, watch. I'll play a mountain and pass. Planes into Stoneforge. Okay. I like how this still doesn't tell you anything. Doesn't answer any of my questions. No, it doesn't. I'm going to get a Lion Sash. Interesting. Right. No, attacks. no attacks. Okay. This time. Doesn't feel right. Probably not, but we'll see. Go Ramanap Ruins. Stomp on the Stoneforge. Mm. You do know that Ramanap Red I... used to be a standard deck. I don't know that it has the strength to be modern. <laughs> All right. Take out the Stoneforge and we pay for the Esper Sentinel. You're insulting the deck already. <laughs> Yes, I feel like that is the appropriate response. <laughs> Let's go flagstones mm -hmm. into combat. Swing in with the Esper Sentinel. Sure, I'll take one. And then extraction specialist. Delightful. <laughs> Are you playing my taxes deck? Yeah, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Grab better skull. Oh, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Josh, that's that's really funny. Don't worry, this is still a taxes channel. <laughs> I'm upholding. Right, I'm going to run out season pyro. I will allow this. All right, and I will pass the turn there. Let's go, Horizon Canopy. <laughs> it really is mine. <laughs> Josh, you've become the very thing you swore to destroy. Absolutely. Uh, Stoneforge in the Caldra. Caldra, yeah. I thought you had that when you grabbed the Lion Sash. Into combat, swing in with air. And I'll keep the Esper Sentinel back. Let's swing in for eight. I'll block the Extraction Specialist. Mm -hmm. Take five, down to 14. Mm, now, I am actually going to Solitude. Okay. Exile the Spyro. What did you exile for Solitude? Exiled a spare Another copy stone of stone punch. I see. Goodbye, Solitude. You did the thing. Mm. You take five, and in my second main, I'm going to play another Esper Sentinel. Weeped. All yours. All mine. Let's play Mountain, Season Pyromancer. Oh, that. This might actually be the game where I have a chance to do something. Hmm. Is this a mono red planeswalker list? Trying to be, yeah. <laughs> All right, pass the turn there. I don't like any of that. It's good, I'm glad. All right, let's go Ghost Quarter. Swing in with the Caldra. I will take it. All right, and then in my second main, we'll play a Lion Sash. Mm. And pass turn. Okay, can play a Mountain, Laka. Yeah, I see. I will pay for one of your Esper Sentinels. Yes. You can draw off the other Hooray. one. Is it something good? Hope so. Tick down Lucker on Season Pyromancer. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, hello, Emrakul. Emrakul the Aeon's turn. And I will pass the turn there. All right. At the end of yours, in a ghost quarter of the flagstones. Sure. Yes, I would like to search. I'll go to planes, thank you. Yes, I would like to search. I'll go to planes, thank you. You're digging, aren't you? Uh, Stoneforge in the batter skull. Mm hmm. And then I'm going to eat the flagstones with the lion sash. Okay. You got all the equipment out. 
And we draw land. Uh, Flagstones. I think I have to do this now. Hello, Solitude. Okay. Gonna eat that emerald. Oh. It's fine. You gained 15 well, I'm back up life. to 26. <laughs> yeah. It ain't bad. It's honest Go work. Combat. Mm -hmm. Let's swing in with the team. And yeah, we'll go with that. Okay. So Germ and so Sentinel are coming at you. The rest is all going at Luca. Okay. No blocks. Excellent. He is bred. Go to my turn. All right. Let's see what you got. I just hope it's not another one. Oh, really? Oh, it's Magus. Magus of the Moon and Bone Crusher Giant. Pass the turn there. All right. Oh, hello. <laughs> Uh, what do I care about more here? I think it is just that. All right, um, go to combat. Swing in with the team. Hmm. I know that there's an amount of damage there. Okay, let's block like that. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna solitude. I see. Target the bone crusher. Okay, I'll gain four. Mm -hmm. And then I'll eat the Luca with the lion sash. Sounds good. Take damage. What do I go down to? 13. 13, okay. I've had worse. Tis but a scratch. Hmm. So you know that old saying, if you can't beat them, join them? Well, that's why you won, Josh. You beat me. <laughs> On to sideboarding. Uh, all right. Round two. Going into game two, Josh has cut four copies of Skyclave Apparition, one copy of Lion Sash, one Eighth Vial, one Giver of Runes, and one Esper Sentinel to make room for three Burrington Forge Tenders, two Sanctifier and Vex, and three Remorseful Clerics. Chip has taken out all four copies of Chalice of the Void, two Priorotic Rituals to bring in two Abrades and four Bolts. Alrighty, round two. Yes. I get to go first. You won the first game. Um, By some sheer miracle, yes. Hmm. I'm going to keep this hand. Uh, I'll mulligan. Keep this one. Mm -hmm. Bottom that. Okay. I'm going to play Mountain and pass. All right. Planes. Forge Tender. Sure. And pass. Mountain. Pass. So this video comes at a really interesting time, doesn't it? What do you mean? You've just moved. I'm about to move. Yeah. Very transitional period in our magic careers, I'd say. Yes, because once, I, uh, once I've once i moved, I might actually get to make content of my own. Mm. So keep your eyes out. <laughs> yeah, of course. And you'll always be welcome here. And you may be welcome on mine, provided you concede some wins every now and then. <laughs> it's not going to happen. Uh, go to combat. That. Swing in with the Forge Tender, yep. and I've also played a Remorseful Cleric. Okay. And past turn. No worries. Let's play Ram and App Ruins, run out Season Pyromancer, mm -hmm. ditch these two, pass the turn there. Ah, there's a thing I wanted to see. All right, Horizon Canopy, Stoneforge. Mm -hmm. Sure. I'm gonna fetch up Caldra. Hmm. Go to combat, swing in for three, and pass ten. Okay. This is a whole new experience for me. I don't know how to feel. <laughs> okay. Desperate ritual. Oops. A braid on the Stoneforge Mystic. That's rude. Oh, he lets it go. Yes. Hmm. Probably a misplay, but we'll see. No, no. I mean, I was just going to go and stomp your face in response to the Forge Tender. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. All right. And then I will go to combat, and I'll swing in for four. Okay. I will take four. Pass it to you. Okie dokie. Ghost quarter. Mm-hmm. Attack. For three. Okay, I'll take it. Yeah, we're just going to do three for now. And then I think that's just the turn. Okay, I will go to combat. I will swing in for three. I will take it. Also, you swung in for four. I did swing in for four. Quick maths. Maths was never my strong suit. <laughs> Let's run out Magus here. Mm, okay. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, pass it there. Going to evoke a solitude. Yeah. Ditching a charming prince, yeah. taking out my Goodbye, magus. magus. I need my lands. All right, and my turn. Okay, we're gonna go to combat. Yep. Swing in for three. Going to take it. I feel like I'm losing this race. Yeah, I mean, I'm hitting you for four, you're hitting me for three, but then one of your lands also hurts you. Yeah, I'll play a forge tender. Okay. And I'm actually gonna play a charming prince. Delightful. And gain three this life. Certainly changes some of the maths. <laughs> Yep. Yes, he is quite charming. Mm, go to my turn. Yes. Let's cast Pyratic Ritual, Plane Bound Accomplice. I see. Activate Plane Bound Accomplice to put a Lucker into play. Lucker will exile the Plane Bound Accomplice. Yes. And get an Emrakul. Hooray. And from there, I will pass the turn. Okie dokie. I am, am in, in danger. <laughs> 
And then in the end step, Laka will go away. Why couldn't he go away earlier? <laughs> you know, like before he could actually do anything. This is not overly helpful. So Emrakul has Annihilator 6. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think you got me. Yeah? Yeah. Yay! <laughs> Round 3. Game 3. Josh has cut three Thalias to bring in two copies of Path to Exile one Giver of Runes, and one Lion Sash, making Josh run the 61 card special. Chip has taken out all four copies of Blood Moon, one copy of Pyretic Ritual, one copy of Magus of the Moon, to bring in four copies of Rabble Master, and two copies of Pithing Needle. You get to go first. Wait. You excited? Not with this hand. Mulligan. I'm also going to mulligan. This one's better, and I think I'll put... Got to be one of these two. I honestly think it's you going to the bottom. Okay, I'm going to keep this one. Throw that back. All right. So let's go planes into Esper Sentinel. Awesome. And pass the turn. Let's go mountain, pass the turn. All right. I like that draw. All right. So Mishra's Factory, Remorseful Cleric. Yep. And then into combat, swing in with the Esper Sentinel and pass. No worries. I'll take it. Excellent. Go to my turn. Mountain, Desperate Ritual, letting you draw. Let me good stuff, please. Desperate Ritual, Plane Bound Accomplice, activate it. Lucker into play, exile the plane bound accomplice. Mm -hmm. Turn to Emrakul, baby. <laughs> Magnificent. Yes. For a moment there, you had me worried. I thought you were playing Storm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Lucker goes away. Sorry, you were worried that I was playing Storm, not that there's a turn to Emrakul. Yes. <laughs> I okay. figured you'd have a transformative sideboard. And hello, <laughs> turn two soldier. All right. Yeah, it's fair. Oh, gaining 15 life's never a bad thing. No, it's not. So 134. And now it is my turn. All right, planes, Aether of Isle, and then I'm going to animate the Mishra's Factory. Mm hmm Go to combat. Yep. And swing in for five. No worries. And pass turn. I'm down to 29. Well... I'll just pass the turn there. Yes, I would like to put a counter on Aether Vial. Thank you. Ghost Quarter. Mm -hmm. do, oh, oopsie. Should I, no, I think I can <laughs> still do this, right? No, I can't. Nope. Dang it. Too late. You could have done it at the beginning of combat. You didn't even attack at all. No, so to, mm, I, I wow. stooged that up enough that I'm just going to walk through combat. You really muddled up that turn, didn't you? This is why I don't win games on this channel. Yeah, I'm just going to pass. No, not even a third land is most unfortunate. I will put a counter on the Eighth of Isle. Mm -hmm. Draw another Ghost Quarter. Mm -hmm. Animate the Mistress Factory. Let's do this properly this time. Sure thing. And swing in for five. Let's cast Lightning Bolt on the Mistress Factory. Yay. Pay one to prevent you from drawing. I was very rude. Sorry, I swear, I'm so sorry. No, I'm not. not You're about as sorry as you were when you were playing Land Destruction. <laughs> that was a good deck. I think I'm just going to pass. I don't like how all you're doing is passing turn. Mm-hmm. Go to combat, swing in for three. I will take it. And pass the turn. In the end step, Bolt on the Esper Sentinel. That's just rude. Pay one to prevent you from drawing. Let's cast Desperate Ritual, Goblin Rabble Master. Mm -hmm. Go to combat, goblin token, swing in for one. Yes. Take down to 19, pass the turn there. All right. Aether Vial trigger, I am going to uptick it. And I feel like I just got punished for that. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Maybe not. Stoneforge. Ooh. And I am going to search. I'm going to search for the Caldra. Go to combat. Swing in for two. I will take it. And pass turn. Pithing Needle. Mm -hmm. Naming Aether File. Naming Stoneforge Mystic. Rude. Go to combat. Make a goblin token. Mm -hmm. Swing with the two goblin tokens. I'm just going to point point this out. You, you know Aether Vial was a legal target, yes? Yes. Just confirming. I'm going to Aether Vial in an extraction specialist. He's sure. going to get the Esper Sentinel. Mm -hmm. And then I'll block one of the goblins, block the other goblin, and call that blocked. Okay. Pass the turn there. All right. Eighth of Isle ticking up. Let's go to combat. Mm -hmm. Swing in for two. I'll take it. And then Lion Sash. Mm -hmm. And pass turn. Remanap Ruins. Oh, no, the third land. Mm -hmm. Make a goblin token. Swing in for one. Yep. And I'll block with the Stoneforge. Mm -hmm. 
And then I'm going to eat Luca with the Lion Sash. Cast a Braid, targeting the Lion Sash. That's rude. And I will pay one to prevent you from drawing. No, not me Lion Sash. Pass it then. All right, let's take up the vial. Play a Horizon Canopy. Go to combat. Swing in for two. I will take it. And then we... Down to 17. Oakley doakley. Hey, look, I halved your life total. <laughs> <laughs> We can just say the 35 was your starting life total, right? Let's run out season pyromancer. Yup. Discard a card, play a scavenger grounds, make a goblin. Goblin has to attack. Get block with the stone forge. Pass it there. I'm going to say always no to Aether Vial from now on. Oh, there we go. There's something I would like to see. Burrington. Hmm. Go to combat, swing in for two in the air. Yep. And pass turn. No worries. There's something unsatisfying about knowing I've dealt 20, 20 damage to you when you're still alive. Hmm. Let's run out Magus. Mm, I see. Damn right you do. Oh. Uh Going to ghost quarter the horizon canopy. Yep. Yes, I would like to search and I'll get a planes. Thank you. That is all. Oh, go to my turn. Well, my combat. Make goblin token. Swings in for one. Yep. Burrington's going to block it. Sure. Pass the turn there. Going to say no to the eighth of aisle. Going to draw another eighth of aisle and play it. And then we're going to go to combat. Swing in for two. I'll take it down to 13. My lucky number. Hmm. Go to my turn. Well, that's a good draw. I don't want to hear that. Season pie. Romancer. Yeah, I didn't want to hear that. <laughs> I mean, it is just a solid draw. You're goddamn right. Yes. I will draw two cards, yep. make a goblin, mm -hmm. go to combat, just attack with the goblin. Uh, block with the Burnton. Mm hmm. Pass it there. Sweet. Got a bit of back and forth going here. Yes, yeah, so I would like to put a counter on that Aether Vial. No, I don't want to touch this one. Well, it's looking good that there's. Um, a slow and steady rhythm to this game. Swinging with the yeah. remorseful cleric. I will take it down to 11. And I will pass turn. Okay, going to my turn. Well, that's a bit of fun. Bolt <coughs> the remorseful cleric. Hmm, I see. I'm going to sack the burn turn mm -hmm. to prevent the damage of the lightning bolt. No worries. I will pay one mm -hmm. to prevent you from drawing. Then I'm going to run out season pyromancer, mm -hmm. discard and draw. Mm -hmm. Play a mountain, make a goblin. This isn't a light swing in. Go attacking. This attack is an act of desperation. Mm, I'm going to block the goblin. I'm just taking the rest. Vile Ooh. in the solitude. Yep. Target the rabble master. Sure. So I gain three. Yep. And I lose you six. You take six. Pass it there. And in your end step, I'm going to vile in a forge tender. Interesting. <laughs> Okay, so no to the first file, yes to the second. Okie dokie. Let's go to combat and swing in for three. I will take it down to 11. And I'll just pass turn there. No worries. Let's go to combat, swing in for six. Mm, I'm gonna block one, two, three. Yep, that happens. Too easy. No damage back up to 22. Pass the 10. And if yours, I'm going to vial in a remorseful cleric. Yep. All right. So first vial trigger is a no. Second vial trigger is going to be a no as well. I mm -hmm. feel like it happened again. I got punished unnecessarily. <laughs> Go to combat. Swing in for five. Yep. I will take five. All right. And in my second main, going to play an extraction specialist. I see. Mm -hmm. Now, I think I'm going to extract. A lion sash. Yep. And pass turn. Gonna make dudes with my seasoned pyro. Yep. Gonna eat one of the other seasoned pyros with the lion sash. Yep. Did I get there? Not yet. Anger of the gods. That's not what I want to see. Sack the forge tender. Yep. Choose anger of the gods. Pay the one. Pass the turn there. All right. Now to my turn, neither of the vials are going to tick up. Mm -hmm. And we're going to reconfigure the Lion Sash onto a Remorseful Cleric. Ah, uh, dear. Go to combat, swing in for five in the air. Sure, I'll take it. And I'm going to eat the Plain Band Accomplice. And that will give you the game. I did it. I could retire. <laughs> I could retire from this channel. Well, you got me, Josh. Ugh. This has been such a journey. <laughs> I want to thank Stoneforge uh, Mystic. I want to thank Remorseful uh, Cleric. 
I want to thank extraction specialist. Uh, I was just like, I drew the anger of the gods. And I'm like, well, I just, I wanted a, a uh, stomp, a bone crusher giant to go along with it. So then I could still wipe the board, but I just never hit it, which was unfortunate. But well, well played. You got me. I have one last. And we made a taxes player out of well, you. I was going to say I have one last uh, thanks to give. And it is to the wonderful Chip K for teaching me how to play taxes without him even realizing. <laughs> <laughs> turns out when you study his videos every week you learn <laughs> yeah, well you, i'll be honest you're quite a good taxes player <laughs> how did you like the deck yeah look after what as after watching you play this um this particular list with extraction specialist i actually really liked the card and wanted to give it a try myself yeah i was thinking about giving it a go today as well i'm glad i didn't <laughs> All right. Well, look, Josh, thank you for playing with me and everybody else. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video and until next time, have fun and goodbye from me and goodbye from me.